using the mode Pending Status. Switch to this mode using the Select Template and Mode window. Click OK if you want to use this mode on an existing tab or create new to create a new tab with the corresponding template. Using this template, you can apply future item statuses to existing items. This mode uses the Morpher Apps private API. You have a few options to create your dataset. You can copy paste a list of items from an external report. If item status control is at master level, then only master org level status changes are supported. We also provide user forms to enter or complete your dataset. You can double click on any record you'd like to see or open this user form from the main ribbon. Your Oracle setup is automatically loaded. You can see your list of pending statuses. Only future dated pending statuses are allowed. When closing a user form, it always performs validation. Finally, you can use the default values row to default some values on the blank rows below. You can always override this value with another value for certain records. Then when your dataset is ready, you can validate the dataset only or validate and upload. Then upload a selection previously highlighted or upload everything on this tab. Duplicate pending statuses for the same date are not allowed, as the message explains here. Using this mode, you can also delete pending statuses, copy-paste a list of items. You can enter various criteria, then download using the criteria highlighted. You can then enter yes to delete these pending statuses. Then highlight the pending statuses you'd like to delete and upload the selection. These pending statuses have been deleted.